Hi everyone. It's Monday, September 4th. It's also the 15th day of Elul and it's Labor Day. Happy Labor Day, a day that we celebrate and honor all those uh, laborers, all those who have contributed to the economy and the work that is done in our country. And it's during this month of Elul that we work as Jews to prepare ourselves for the holy days ahead that are really coming right around the corner. So I have been using this book um, on a daily basis, preparing your heart for the holy days. And I am gonna share with you one of the pieces from it today from Carrie Olitsky and Rachel Sabbath. It's based on Psalm 27, which is the Psalm that we read during these holy days. And this verse is in the Psalm. Listen, Adonai, when I cry aloud, have mercy on me, answer me. This is what the authors write. Listen, please God, listen to me. It's all that I ask. I know I may not always deserve it, but I come before you having cleansed the broken pieces of my soul. I struggle daily to repair what I have done wrong, to redirect the course of my life has taken over these past months. The effort consumes me. It's all that I can think about, all that occupies my waking hours. And just when my strength seems depleted, I feel renewed through the process of repentance. I long to be restored to wholeness. I turn to you knowing that I can achieve it only through my relationship with you. When we pray, we want God to respond. Rabbi Nachman of Bratislav, the Bratislava Rebbe taught us about something called the silent scream, the kind that escapes from deep within our soul, erupting when we least expect it without making a sound. Help me, we scream silently, although we are working hard to prepare ourselves for the year ahead. Teshuva does not always seem to work precisely the way that we planned, no matter how hard we work, but that's the nature of the human path to change, winding and circuitous with roadblocks everywhere. Often we get in our own way. It is time for us to get out of our way and start on God's way. So we take this time during Elul to work on ourselves, to prepare ourselves for the holy days ahead. We look forward to you joining us. We have so many really exciting and interesting opportunities for worship and learning for the holy days ahead. You need to renew your membership to make sure that you'll get the links so that you can join us for all of our holy day online offerings. And on September 9th, you can come by the temple and pick up your mock sores and it's a food drive as well. So bring food for the kosher food bank and pick up your mock sore and you will be ready on your way to get ready for the high holy days ahead. A Shana Tova, a happy and healthy new year to each one of you and your families. And I hope to see you soon. Bye.